for the two part plug, as you can see the seam there, all you need to do is push the tab down, or you can pry this up, but get one side going. Then once you get the second side going, the plug's only going to separate that far. And if you anybody wants to know, the blue wire there is for electric brakes if I ever put them in. Uh, once it's that far along, you can act. You actually will be able to remove this the pin and clean it up if you need be. These have never been cleaned or removed, and they've worked on this 2000 model. But if you had a, a damaged plug, that that is one option. Then you slide slide it in until it clicks, and then you can just squeeze the plug back together. Make sure you get the polarity right, the black and on the right side and the white on the right side. For the one part plug, I don't suggest trying that because you need the special tool. And I'll show you what a one part plug looks like. Now this here is my 1997 parts trailer. However, as you see, can see, as you can see the trailer har wiring harness comes out, and right here is the 12 volt harness, and here's the brakes. Um, same thing though, it has the black and white wires, and they're coming out and they have a plug. If you look at this plug, it's different. This is the one piece plug. Um, and that you cannot separate. It has the pins in it. Uh, yeah, it's 97. Pins actually are in just fine condition. But if you need it to separate it, this one takes, like I said, takes a special tool. This is a pin removing tool. Uh, if you know somebody who works in electronics, uh, they will have this. And all it does is you stick it over the pin. You'll see that it pushes it pushes the plunger up and push that out and here comes the pin on this one be able to clean it up then make sure the locking tabs reinsert it insert it all the way oops the locking tabs pry those out a little bit these locking tabs I'm prying out are actually what this tool pushes down on so it can come out there you go, this one's back together. But that's the difference between a one and a two part plug. Um, the, I do have both of these available, the one part and the two part. Uh, the two part plug, of course, you could take it off and just replace the plug. This one you can take off and replace it with the special tool. But um, it's a Coleman uh, Camper 12 volt battery harness plug. Again, this is Ryan with Camper Solutions and thank you for your time.